The short bead stair is a colorful set of beads, each color representing a unit number. Color coding them makes it easier to identify how many units there are in each strand. This way the child can focus on the number rather than counting it out. It makes it easier for them to do quick and simple math, making them more practical in doing simple math in their heads. The bead stair is used for the teen board, for basic arithmetic, and for the snake game, which incorporates simple equations, exchange, and remainders. It also shows the child how the units are growing to become a 10 bar. You could order the official material online. There's a wide range of prices for Montessori materials. You could make them yourself using beads and pipe cleaners. You could use Unifix cubes or Legos, or you can use paper. I made a downloadable pattern for making your own paper tens and units that you can print, cut, and use. Look for the link below. I recommend laminating so your paper materials last longer. You could also print the numbers on card stock or glue them onto cardboard or construction paper. When teaching the bead stair, you want to use a three period lesson. This is one bead bar. This is two bead bar. This is three bead bar. I only use bead bar in the introduction of it. The rest, I'm just gonna use the number. Show me three, show me two, show me one. What is this? What is this? What is this? That's how you teach the short beads until the child knows what each unit bead represents. To help the child get familiar with the bead stair, have them match the short beads to their appropriate number. You also use the three period lesson when teaching the quantity of the teens. So for example, 10 plus one is 11. 10 plus two is 12. 10 plus three is 13. Show me 13, show me 12, show me 11. You can isolate it at this point or if it's easier, you can just leave it there. What is this? What is this? What is this? Have fun.